Hello everyone, thank you for joining me. I'm making another A5 size card in portrait orientation. So for this card I have used a new gold card, also beautiful uh, French champagne luster card and uh, floral finery I have used are lacy tips and the gems I've used for these are champagne gymporium gems which I'm gonna have to take out these are champagne gymporium gems beautiful one of my favorites and I use them a lot <laughs> on my cards uh, also some uh, whimsy foliage from a new release from Phil sentimentally yours uh, the um, layer differently dies I have used our uh, elegance rectangle and where are they there they are elegance rectangles and i absolutely love this shape for my sentiment i die cut um, these two and these are from oh hang on i've got something else under uh, these are from Charmed Flags and Banners. I have used uh, this one here. And um, as you can see, this one is not French Champagne. Uh, so what I have done, because I need to stamp a sentiment on this, on these two colors, the French Champagne Luster card, and vanilla cream are very similar as you can see uh, because i have to stamp my sentiment on it you still can stamp your sentiment on luster card the only thing is uh, your ink is gonna dry slightly longer because it's a luster card uh, so i decided to cut the top layer as super similar uh, to french champagne luster and I have used vanilla cream, so my ink is going to dry nice and quick. Uh, so let's go. I've got um, embossing folder. Uh, this is Heart Lattice embossing folder. Look how beautiful it is. And this layer is on the foam tape. So I'm taking tape backing off and I'm going to stick it down. I have to say, as always, I really enjoyed making samples um, with this beautiful new uh, flower and foliage collection and I hope um, I did give you some sort of inspiration. So this is down. And I'm going to put this one aside now for sentiment. Uh, sentiment I'm going to use is from Elegance Script Essential Sentiments. And the one I'm going to use says just for you. Let's have a look if it's going to fit here. Oh, it fits here perfectly, because I, I believe um, these were designed um, to complement each other. Because, as you can see, and I will show you now, you have got these pendy ones, which are... Uh, these over here that are going to fit perfectly in these dies. Then you've got uh, some larger ones 
that are fit perfectly gonna fit perfectly in this one and you've got some um, smaller ones that you can put in any of those so I decided to use these sentiments and it says just for you I'm going to use Versafine Claire Nocturne ink pad going to ink my stamp and make sure it's in the middle stamp it stamp 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 hold on hold on <laughs> and take it off okay i'm going to clean my stamp straight away because you want your stamps to be clean close it and I'm going to glue it down and as soon as I glue it down I will show you what it looks like uh, do a little Close up for you of our sentiment topper. Press it down. Uh, this is what it says just for you. I absolutely love this font, it is amazing. Now back to our card, as always flowers are going on the glue gel and the glue gel I'm using is pin flare, pin flare glue gel and I'm gonna start from this side, from the middle and glue gel another flower just arranging them like so oh i love these lacy flowers love 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 them so much Uh, now this one is going on the foam tape so I need a little bit of foam tape and I'm going to put it down now because it's an embossed layer I'm going to put it on I'm going to do a little bit of glue gel underneath And I have to make sure that it's straight and I do have to look several times because my eyes are getting tired it's midnight it's midnight and I haven't finished yet okay that looks good so I'm going to just press it down a little bit more Oh my god look how beautiful these flowers are these two colors together look amazing let me just have a quick look where the rest of the flowers are gonna go I don't know whether to leave some of those off actually I do want I do want to put them on but I don't want to cover much of this frame 
so they might stay of the card actually and now i'm going to put some uh, whimsy foliage i'm just having a look that it's where the glue gel is yes um, so i've got four of these and i want them symmetrical just making sure it's in the glue gel and yes it is but these ones i am going to chop slightly um how many how many shall we say three chopping off three bottom ones And now I've got some options for them to go this way or for them to go this way. And let's have a quick look. Or over here. No, I do like these on the side. So a bit of glue gel again, and I'm going to tuck it under. Like so just peeking out slightly. Glue gel and under. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm not quite sure what is going on with this one. And it did not stick. Ah. Okay. It does look good now. Oh, look how beautiful it is. It's a shame not to use all those flowers, <laughs> but I really want to showcase this beautiful frame on this card. Oh. It's okay, I will. I might make just a little dinky one. Oh, shall we put a couple of these in here? A few of these. Or just one. You kind of need something on that corner there. Or maybe I'm just going to put this one on top of these. Hmm. Decisions. Oh my God. I know this little one. This little baby one is definitely going on here. Now right on the peak. So this one definitely is going over here. I can't believe I can't decide. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> I think I might actually leave. Uh, this card like this um i maybe have over prepped few flowers Need to move it a little bit i'll move this one a little bit i don't know maybe in final pictures after the video the ones i've got after each video i have close-up pictures you might see some more flowers on this card so don't be surprised don't be surprised 
I'm yet to make my final decision whether I'm gonna need more flowers or not. <laughs> I'm taking the champagne gymporium gems and placing them in four corners. I can move this one back. Um, so stay tuned until the very end of this video and we will see if I decided to put some more flowers on or not. Uh, so thank you for, very much for watching <laughs> until next time bye